Hello, I'm Silver. We will talk about invention of telescopes. A telescope is an optical instrument using lenses, curved mirrors, or a combination of both to observe distant objects, or various devices used to observe distant objects by their emission, absorption, or reflection of electromagnetic radiation. The history of the telescope can be traced back to the invention of the earliest known telescope, which appeared in 1608 in the Netherlands, when a patent was submitted by Hans Lippershey, an eyeglass maker. The design of these early refracting telescopes consisted of a convex objective lens and a concave eyepiece. Objects resembling lenses dated back 4,000 years although it is unknown if they were used for their optical properties or just as decoration. In terms of physics, you are being familiar with one of the lenses. With both convex lenses, one is objective and the other eyepiece. As soon as the ray comes from the distant source and comes towards the objective lens, the rays then deviate together and passes around focus. There are two images obtained, one small and the other large according to the objective and eyepiece lens, as the distant object is placed far ahead. The angle between a ray and a principal axis is same in opposite side, marked as alpha for the objective lens, and beta for the eyepiece lens respectively. This obtains the formula for magnification, equals tan beta by tan alpha. That's the ray diagram we've talked about. During the 1850s, reflectors suffered from problems with speculum metal mirrors, and a considerable number of great refractors were built from 60 cm to 1 m aperture, culminating in the Yerkes Observatory refractor in 1897. In 1931, the era of radio telescopes was then born, which is used to detect radio waves from astronomical radio sources in the sky. Since the 1960s, the development of space observatories were allowed access to several bands including UV rays, X-rays, and longer wavelength infrared bands. So, this video is about invention of telescopes. Like, comment, and subscribe now.